an athlete, good, right. well-rounded receivers. What have you worked on? How have you seen yourself uh, make strides in that area? Um, I think it's Coach McGuire um, really puts emphasis on getting on the jugs uh, for all the receivers. Um, do a lot of pat and go before practice, so I think that's been working a lot. How much confidence have you uh, gained this spring from where you were at last fall? Um, I would say I'm really confident going into the year. Um, just getting a little bit of, I didn't have a spring last year, so just getting this under my belt, and getting more comfortable with the offense has been good. Can you talk us through that touchdown? We saw you take the top off the defense a couple times last year, but what was what was happening on that play? What enabled you to, to get so open? Um, I seen that it was in like a um, quarters type look, um, so I knew that the safety would be um, in the low zone. So I tried to keep my O skinny, and Dylan just put it right on money. So. I mean, Triple jump in the end zone as your celebration? Is yes, that sir. what you're doing? Yes, sir. Um, just being on the track team, too, how much do you think that helps just, you know, your football game? I think it helps a lot. Um, track is um, like a you're by yourself sport, so you kind of learn how to like depend on yourself. And then you tie that along with football. It's you versus you, but then you have a team to go along with that. I think that's really important for a competitive standpoint. How many polls today? For you to do this in front of a crowd, maybe right. you've been doing it all spring, but to do it today. Um, I would say that the crowd just—it's just, it's just um, for fun. They—they um, they obviously love it. We love the crowd out there, but we do this every day, so it's like it's nothing new to us. What do you think of your room in general? Just that their receiver position. Yeah, we do. We're doing it great so far. We had a really good spring. Um, a lot of new guys, um, two transfers that came in. Um, they taught us a lot, just learning how to be better receivers. How have you seen yourself grow from, you mentioned this point last year, you didn't have a spring, right. to now finding your groove? What, what have you seen as the biggest difference, biggest change in your game? I would say just getting more comfortable with the plays. Um, been uh, really focused on getting into the playbook, paying attention to learning more than just um, outside receiver, trying to get into a little bit of the slot. What have you learned from the older transfer, like the Andy Mall? Um, I would say it's little things like um, maybe running a route at a different um, angle or how to get off of the press, things like that. How's it been working just with all the quarterbacks and all the new, you know, fresh faces this year, and how has your chemistry grown with each of them? I think um, all three quarterbacks are doing a great job. Um, it's been good. They've been, we make sure we get a lot of catches in with the quarterbacks, make sure we communicate on plays. That's been really important this year. Are you about the same weight-wise, or have you added some muscles since last year? I've added about five pounds since last year. Where you at him right about 172. Is that right where you want to be or you want to add a little more? I want to get up to like 180. I hate to see injuries. Um, obviously, Demetrius going down in the middle, so it was probably pretty significant. Just what did he do this spring? Um, and just can you speak to how difficult it is to see one of your guys go down? Uh, for sure, it's always difficult when one of your teammates get injured, uh, especially when we have seen what Demetrius has done. Um, he worked really hard every day. Um, so, yeah, we're praying for him. What are you identifying as your goals as we get into the summer and get towards the fall? Um, I would just say, um, like I said before, being a complete receiver, um, doing that, uh, having a big year for all of us. How confident are you just in all the quarterbacks and knowing that no matter what, you always probably have someone pretty competent back there? All right. I think um, the confidence has been um, stored in practice, uh, just getting reps in with all of them. They all look pretty good, so I'm confident in all of them. What do you think the ceiling of this offense is right now compared to what it was a year ago? Um, I'd say that we got a um, very high ceiling. Um, is everybody doing their job, um, focus on not turning over the ball? I'd say we would be pretty good. Are you doing outdoor track too? Uh, I'm, I might be uh, doing outdoor track. Are you the fastest guy in your receiver room? And if it's not you, who are some other guys that are in that conversation? Uh, well, if you ask me, I say I would. I, I am. But right now, I got to give it to Ja'Cory Barney. He's pretty fast. He got the fastest miles per hour right now on the team. You guys raced? You no, we haven't. Here. We haven't, but we should. Ja'Cory had a good day today. Yeah. I'd like to see him excel. It's been fun seeing Ja'Cory play. He's a really exciting player. Um, he's learned quick. Um, kind of reminds me of myself a little bit in the fact that smaller guy, but really fast. So excited to see him play. How fun would you just say the room is right now and how close you know all you guys are? Yeah it's been we've been bonding like super close. Um, we hang out together, watch film together like without coaches around. So I think that's been building a lot of chemistry. Any other questions?
Thanks, Jalen. Thanks, Jalen.